Planner friends, it's Nia. Welcome to Life with Nia. Today I am doing just a quick video. Um, I got a couple of questions about whether or not the Hobonichi Cousin kit would fit in the HP Mini, which yes, it would. It's not sized for HP Mini, it's sized for the Hobonichi Cousin. However, the stickers are small enough that it would work. So this is a Hobonichi Cousin. Um, and this is what the stickers from the kit look like inside of the Hobonichi Cousin. Um, they are similar in size. As you can see here, it's Hobonichi Cousin's a little bit taller. Um, also, the, the one of the things you have to consider is the inserts that you're using in your HP Mini. So I am using cloth and papers inserts vertical lined weeklies um but the the stickers are these are i think one inch square where's my ruler um of course i don't have a ruler at all around these parts how is that even possible I buy rulers every year back to school. I buy like three, four, five of them at Walmart because they're like 50 cents. And I can't find a ruler to save my life around here. Okay, here's this little Aaron Condrick one. So these are one, about 1.25 by 1.25. So. So you could really do that even in a personal size planner or a pocket size planner. Those would fit. These are size for the little Hobonichi Cousin box. And they are about three quarters of an inch long. So let me show you how I would put them in here. Um... I use the Studio Bliss Co. Weekly Mini Kits in my HP Mini. I also use some other stickers in here. This is not one that I really show on camera, but um, I've got, I like this as more of a luxury luxe look. So I've got all kinds of different stuff in here. I, I just feel like there's flexibility to it. So I would put my day of the week, me personally, just covering the day of the week. I'd leave the number out. This kit does not include number stickers. I do have some little numbers that are left over from something that I could stick on there. That's not necessary. That's just if you want to do extra, right? So I would put these on the day of the week just for the decorative purposes. Um, I love this Dark Knight kit because it's it's Halloween without being Halloween-y. Um, uh, you could really use it anytime, not just Halloween. So I've got these Day of the Weeks. And then for me, I'm just continuing to... Oh, time changes on Sunday. Boo. I'm just going to continue to like use this the same way I use any of my planners. So I always like to have this week, next week, planner time, happy mail somewhere in here. So I usually put happy mail on Friday. For me, this is just a header. It doesn't need to go all the way across. It fits nicely there. Does not fit in between the lines, but I'm okay with that. Um, these are thinner lines. We put our, I like this week up here at the top, my checklist, platter time, and next week. And then, um, there are, these are like appointment type labels. This one is a box. So I'm going to do the 
box up here for payday. And then um, I have something else tentatively scheduled for the 31st. So that is that. Um, you've got like a weekend sticker here that you could use. You've got washi. So the washi, this is where things might get a little interesting. So I would put this one here. And then this one's going to be a little long, so I'm going to put it down and then trim it. So now we've got our washi at the bottom of the page. Um, if you like the habit track, there are, is a habit tracker. And then... Um, I do have PTO on this day, so I'm going to put that on there. I'm not going to use the weekend sticker, but I could put it here. I just like the little floral element there, so I'm going to leave that alone. Lots of extra boxes here that I don't necessarily need, but you may like them. Another thing that you could do is the thinner washi strips. Um, if you want to, like, break this section up here, that could go there and you have that and so there that's that then um, with these decorative elements so we've got on Halloween our little hat I'm not going to be able to do a whole spread and not have a doll on here somewhere. So, for me, I need a doll. You might not need one. I need a quote as well. Um, so, these are some, some additional, like, decorative header strips. Um, I'm not going to use those. Then you've got some flags. So, if you want to flag something in particular, you could use those as well. Um, and then I love my little dots. And so these are smaller dots that, that are so sized for a smaller planner. So these actually do fit nicely in these, in between these lines. If you're using a, um, lined planner, um, and I can't speak to every lined planner and the distance because this is not a kit for every lined HP mini planner. It's a kit for a Hobonichi cousin. So the dots are sized for the Hobonichi cousin, but on these particular inserts from cloth and paper, they do work nicely um, and fit on the lines that are here. So we've got that. And then let's see. out there sneezing and pacing. Um, I'm going to actually use the same kit in my Hobonichi Cousin for next week. So, let me look and see what dolls I have that will go with this. This one is perfect. feel like I need to make some smaller size dolls. There's some, but I don't think I have anything in purple. Try to keep the color aesthetic going here. This is a good one. It goes 
with anything. On Mondays, we drink coffee. And on Tuesday and Wednesday and Thursday. And Friday and Saturday and Sunday. Okay, so got that on there. And then I like to always add in... A quarter, three or four or five. So... Keeping with our same purple, say more coffee, and repurpose this habit tracker to be a organize my life habit tracker and that is like really it that's me using the Hobonichi Cousin Kit in the HP Mini so Hobonichi Cousin Kit not designed for the HP Mini but the stickers definitely you can make them work in there lots of goodies left over and maybe you plan different than I plan and you use things that I wouldn't use um, but there is not a sticker on here that would not work for some purpose um, in the HP Mini. So I like that. It's cute. I might use the Hobonichi Cousin more frequently in this planner um, because it just works. It works in here. So let me know if you have any other questions or if you want to see me use um, any of the Studio Bliss Co. kits in any other planners. I can only show you what I actually have. I actually have HP Mini, so I'm able to show that. I have H I have um Hobonichi Cousin. I have the standard seven by nine size. I have the A5 Daily Duo. I have a seven by nine daily duo. So I can show you a few things. I don't have any happy planner items. I, I may have some old, like if you just want to see it, I can probably find some old outdated inserts um to show you what it might look like in there. But I try to make the kits universal so you can use them anywhere. So um our weekly mini kits um also work in the hp mini but if you're wanting like different shapes of things the hobonichi cousin kit is a good option for that because you've got the square stickers and um more functional and decorative headers and boxes and things so let me know what you think if you have any questions don't forget to like and subscribe and i'll see you back here next time bye